Today I walked out before my interview even started. I had an interview today that was scheduled in advance by a well-known employer. Upon arriving, the store was having a bit of a rush. I thought it was weird they would schedule me for an interview at what would be considered a peak time for this type of business, but didn't really think much of it. I waited in line and once it was my turn told the lady working the front that I was there for an interview. She called to another employee who approached me immediately with an attitude. She began questioning me about the interview as though she thought I was making the entire thing up and somehow personally inconveniencing her. She then rolled her eyes at me and told me to take a seat and wait until the manager was available to speak with me. I did. I had been waiting for several minutes at this point and I kept feeling someone staring at me. It was the same lady from earlier and she was legitimately shooting daggers at me the entire time. At one point, I saw her pull another employee to the side. This was someone who looked like they could possibly be a manager from what I could only assume. This guy was more formally dressed than everyone else who were just wearing the standard company. Issued uniform. She whispered something to him and they both looked at me. They then proceeded to laugh and smirk at me. Around this time, I decided to nope the heck out of there. I still have no idea what I did to upset this lady or maybe she was just having an off day. However, I decided if this was any indication of what was to come. I wasn't going to stick around to find out. I really wish I wouldn't have spent my money on a lift to get there but at least I think I dodged a bullet. Woman shrugging medium light skin tone. Always 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 go with your gut. If an interview doesn't feel right just leave. You could be wrong and miss out on a good opportunity but most of the time you'll be right so just leave before it has a chance to negatively affect you. If anything, find out who the owner, franchisee is and contact them about the abusive behavior you received from a staff that you feel blessed to not to have to work with. Google Review M I left my first day of a new job last week on account of rude, unorganized and unprofessional behavior by the staff. HR called me to confirm pay for that day and asked me if something had happened. I told her what happened. She apologized and praised me for leaving. When you know you know. Definitely follow that gut. That's called dodging a bullet, friend. The only thing I would add, is that I would have emailed the person you would have interviewed with to describe why you know ped. Out of working in a toxic atmosphere. You spent money on a life lesson. Imagine working alongside, under that woman. Bullet definitely dodged. Report those employees to the owner, boss. Am I really the only one that would have said something to them directly? IDK. ID rather be an asshole with a purpose I guess. No wonder they're looking for spots to fill. Dodged a bullet. No reason not to name the company. You were probably interviewing for the lady's position. And she probably knew it. If I was you, I would let the regional manager know your experience with that place and your interview process. And why you left. I am sure they would be interested to know. Please write them and explain that their poor behavior is why you won't work there. What's the company? You did the right thing. I once interviewed for a position as chemical lab manager, admin. The lead scientist interviewed me. When I sat in his office I noticed he had socks on. No shoes. Must have been airing out his feet. As we spoke, he took out a huge salad. Then a can of sardines. He proceeded to open the can and put sardines on his salad. Then he slurped some of the fishy oil from the can. Why God why didn't I just leave? I need a duver. 
You never get treated better than you will at an interview. If the interview is a disaster it's time to get the hell out. I am glad you were able to lift yourself by your bootstraps and get out of there. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.